welcome back to my video. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So, um, I, I've been shopping. So that's it's quite naughty. But um, I've been shopping for the, like the last few weeks, and I picked up some really cool things that I wanted to come here and just show you guys. Have like a really nice sit down, just chit chat with you guys, and show you guys everything I picked up. Um, I know now it's like November, there's a lot of sales going on and I, I picked up some cool bits which I'm very, very impressed with. So without this long intro, grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a cuppa. But before I go, um, everything that I mentioned in this video below, if I can find any of these items online, I'll link it down below. So check the description box below. So if you have any questions, any inquiries, I feel like everything will be down below for you. So make sure you check that out. But without this long intro, let's jump right in to the video. Okay, so I picked up a few bits from Primark, nothing major. So I feel like I didn't want to do a separate video showing you guys a Primark haul because I only picked up a few bits. So I thought it's only like fair to show you guys what I picked up in this video I, so I guess I'll get the Primark haul part of the video out of the way first okay so so from Primark um, I picked up some cute things cute healthy things if that even made any sense <laughs> so the first thing I picked up is this gorgeous mirror so the mirror looks like so I just fell in love with it as soon as I saw it I was like this is the most beautiful mirror I have ever seen plus because the aesthetic in my room is kind of like a bit of gold so I thought let me pick this up and this was only seven pounds guys seven pounds for a mirror is a really a really decent price so I thought I'd pick it up and I love it so right now in Primark I feel like the home collection is really really nice they have quite a few bits for the house they have like a lot of gold accents as well so like a lot of trays a lot of mirrors and um, even like gold candles as well so, so if you have a colored kind of theme in your room um definitely go down to Primark because I feel like they have a really some really really cool bits and I picked these stuff up from Primark in Foss Park so I'm not too sure about everyone else's Primark but the one in Foss Park definitely have all of these stuff that I picked up and I picked these stuff um recently so they should still have them right the next item I picked up is this this huge chunky jumper I just I love it this was 13 pounds and I got this in a size small I just love the color the color just screams autumn to me and it's literally the most comfiest softest jumper ever I hate when I pick up a knit and it's like so scratchy or it's like really really thick that you can't breathe when you put it on and this is the perfect combo one thing I will say about this jumper though is shreds a lot so I had this jumper on with a black coat over it and the coat was like literally it basically turned brown if if that makes any sense so this jump on fortunately does shred a lot but I mean if you're not wearing it with anything black I suppose if you wear this like out on its own then you should be absolutely fine I wasn't really happy about that as such but um, nevertheless the jump is super cute so I guess it makes up for it and I just I oh, this just makes me so happy this is like autumn in a jumper and I love it okay so if you watch my um, previous video which is basically my weekly vlog that I uploaded just before this video you guys would have seen that I um, a few of these bits I picked up from Primark i.e. the jumper and the boots but if you haven't then these are some of the stuff I picked up from Primark but basically in that vlog I kind of showed you guys around Primark and some of the stuff I picked up and I had a really crazy challenge to do so if you haven't watched that definitely go ahead and watch it because it was actually a really fun video so I'll leave it linked down below for you but nevertheless I picked these really funky crazy leopard print um, boots from Primark and I think it's really cute it's a little bit different a little bit outside my comfort zone because it is quite out there but I feel like with a plain black outfit and maybe that that jumper I feel like it'll look really really nice and especially for autumn I think you'll be like the perfect autumn person ever my boots collection is pretty simple it's mostly black yeah I feel like all my boots are black I think except for one I think I have like a nudie cream but apart from that all my uh, boots are black and very like uniform so I thought let me go out of my comfort zone a little bit try something different and I saw these and this caught my attention and it went and it was only nine pounds so a very very good bargain Okay, so moving on. So from the Primark home, I picked up this beautiful basket. This was, how much was this? This was seven pounds. Wow, really, really good bargain. For some reason, it's got two tags on it. I 
don't get that. But um, yeah, it's a natural round basket that looks like this. And I just fell in love with it because I love the aesthetic um, look to it. I just think it's so nice with like a massive plant in the middle and this kind of tucked in a corner. You can put even blankets in here, like some throws, some pillows if you wanted to. But I would probably just put a plant in here and just pop it like in a corner of one of my living rooms or even my room and stuff like that. Just absolutely love, love, love. Um, I love like plants all over my house. Like my house is just like filled with like real plants, fake plants, just everything plants. My house is like filled with it. So I just love that look. So of course I had to pick this up and it was such a good bargain because I know these go for like at least 15, 20 pounds. But the fact that this was seven pounds and it's quite a decent size, I was like, hell yeah, you're coming in my basket for sure. So very, very impressed. Okay guys, so last but not least from Primark, I picked this really, really cool, quirky kind of like shirt. How do you call it? A shirt? Coat. It's not really a coat as such, but it is thick. So I say it's a shirt dress kind of thing. It looks like that. It's got buttons all the way down. You've got um, some pockets on the sides. It is a really, really thick like shirt. So you could probably wear this outside. I did wear this the other day, but I felt it was. I felt really chilly in it. So you'd probably like. I don't think this is like the most winter appropriate. Um, as such but especially not in the UK at the moment because it's absolutely freezing but I mean maybe if you like wore like a jumper underneath it then maybe you'd be fine or um, depends how cold you are but I feel the cold a lot so this by itself would not keep me warm that's for sure but nevertheless I really really liked it I just love the way it fits it's really like loose slouchy this with like some boots um, knee high boots or even like if you want to wear leggings or black jeans with it I think it look really nice um, I got this in an X small by all means I'm not an X small I'm not size 6 to 8 at all um, but um, it comes up really really big so you have to I feel like you have to downsize with this um, this was £25 which again I feel it's a bit on the higher end for Primark for just a shirt dress it's a bit on the high end but um, nevertheless I just fell in love with it fell in love with the colour um, again, it screams autumn to me, so I picked it up and I actually really like it But for me, I would definitely need something else with it. Maybe like a knitted jumper underneath it I think I'd be fine But nevertheless, I love 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 and it gives you it gives off like a military style look and I am all for it Okay, so that is everything I picked up from Primark and um, I am gonna move on. What should I go for? I'm gonna go for Zara because I only picked up one thing from Zara so I went to um, Zara the other day, I was like going to buy my winter coat because I usually buy one coat a year um, or maybe like two sometimes if I'm cheeky but um, I went into Zara looking for this coat that I really really wanted to pick up but unfortunately it was out of stock um, which made me very sad but anyways long story short um, as I was looking for my coat um, I came across this bag and I was like, oh my god, it's the perfect bag because I was looking for a small kind of just pop around um, bag. I've got like a really nice cream one that I'm not actually looking at right now and a pink one. But um, my black ones are usually like really big and bulky so I needed a little kind of just pop around town kind of bag and I saw this leather one from Zara and I was like you are coming with me because you are like literally the cutest thing ever and I just love 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 how it looks you can hold it like this if you wanted to or around your shoulders and it's just basically leather with gold detailing on it and I think it's very simple very like elegant and only 20 pounds from Zara which I thought is not not a bad price for a little bag and yeah I got it with me and I have been using it every single day since I got it. I, I kid you not, like since I got this, this has kind of been my go-to bag. I just pop everything in here, my phone, my keys, my wallet, like everything, and it's just the perfect size. So I'm very, very happy with this, I must say. Okay, so um, moving on to a River Island. So I went into River Island just not really looking for anything as such as you do you try to just go window shop and i just went in and i saw the most perfect jeans ever like ever so sometimes i kind of want to go for that more of a casual look rather than skinny jeans i don't really like to be honest some people like like wearing skinny jeans on a daily basis i don't know how you do it i feel like skinny jeans just kind of suffocate me i don't know if it's because i've got big bones and my legs just when I wear skinny jeans, I'm just like, oh, I want to take it off ASAP. I mean, it looks nice, but 
my legs are not breathing in it. So, um, I came across these gorgeous jeans from um, River Island, and I was like, yes. I mean, yes, in every single language, you are coming with me. It fit really nice as well. Um, I got it in a size, but I tried two sizes on. I tried 10R and 10 small, and the small was just like the perfect fit ever. So it has that vintage look to it. It's kind of a straight leg, vintage style um, mom jeans that looks like that. It's like a light wash jeans, um, and it's kind of, it comes on comes a bit short so if you're more of a shorter person like I am, I am 5'4", this is the perfect length. So if you're kind of around the same height as me, so go into River Island and try this small. Um, they have different sizes but they have like a regular small and large. The small is the perfect fit ever, like it's wow. The, the height is amazing. So I picked it up and this costs £35 which I thought was actually a really decent price for a pair of jeans. Usually like if you pick up a really good pair of jeans usually like 40 45 pounds so the fact that this was 35 i thought that was a really 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 good price for it and it says the mum jeans um i don't know what style it is it just says denim mum but it's like a vintage style and i love it i absolutely love this this would look really nice with like like a knitted jumper tucked in because this comes up as quite high-waisted which I love I love 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 high-waisted jeans I feel like the low rise is just not for me I love high-waisted stuff and this is high-waisted so I feel like a knit tucked in and then like your coat over your shoulders super cute okay so I nipped into H&M quickly just to have a little browse because I like to go in once in a blue moon and just check what they have and they don't really have anything that kind of caught my attention as, as such um, the coats are very same-ish the jumpers are very same-ish so nothing really like caught my attention but as I was leaving the shop um, I came across this shirt and I was like this is a really 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 good looking shirt um, I have a few events well I had a few events last week and I really need something a bit more on the fancier side so I don't know so I went in looking for something a bit more dressy up and I came across this and I was like this is really nice um, this tucked in with a pair of like skinny jeans, some boots and like a black coat, um, I, th I thought why not. So I picked it up and this was, so I picked this up in a size 8 and this was £18 from um, from H&M and it goes quite long at the bottom and then short at the top and I think this is a really, a really nice looking shirt. Um, even if you put like a crop a black jumper over this or even a white jumper, will look so beautiful and like the shirt just hanging it down. Oh, beaut! Um, I love, love, love. Even this with gold jewellery would stand out so much. So I fell in love with it. Obviously it's not, you can't wear this on its own for this time of year, but laid up with like a knitted jumper, like a nice chunky like coat over it. So cute. So very, very happy with this. And yeah, that is everything I picked up from H&M. Okay, so I'm moving on to a top shop because you guys know I love going into top shop. Top shop is very dangerous. When I go in, I always seem to find something and yeah, just, just uh, there's always something that catches my attention in top shop for some reason. So from top shop, I um, I feel like I mentioned this in like a vlog, but if you haven't watched that vlog, don't worry guys, I got you. I am gonna basically show you guys what I picked up. So, um, talking about skinny jeans, you know how I said to you I don't like just skinny jeans, but I do like to wear it sometimes because I feel like that with like a pair of boots over it looks so nice, like black chunky boots over skinny jeans is so on point. Um, and this with like trainers sometimes, but anyways, long story short, I needed a new pair of black jeans and I always go for the Topshop Lee jeans. Um, in petite and that looks like that it's just plain black jeans but I just seem to always go for the Topshop ones because they're very stretchy they're not thick I hate when like jeans are so thick that your legs can't breathe in it this is very stretchy a very like 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 a very thin material but it's very like black black which is amazing I hate when like black jeans are supposed to be black but they're like kind of faded these don't fade as easily, so um, I'm very impressed with it. I got it in a waist 28 and leg 28, so that's kind of my height and my waist, and it just seems to fit really, really nice. So that is what I picked up from Topshop. Oh yeah, the next thing I picked up is actually this shirt from Topshop. Um, it's basically a white shirt with like turtle 
buttons kind of going all the way around and you got like a pocket here and I just love how loose and slouchy it is it's really nice and this was actually in sale I got this for 12 pounds 12 or 15 pounds reduced from like 30 or 35 pounds so I thought this was a really a really good bargain so I picked it up and um, it probably needs a bit of an iron but we're just gonna ignore that so, but I just needed a new white shirt and this was just quite my name and plus it was in sale so it's two in one Okay, so on to the topic of winter coats. I found the most beautiful coat ever in Miss Selfridge. So Miss Selfridge is not really a place I go to shop in often. I feel like the stuff is just not my style to be fair with you, but I found the most gorgeous kind of waterfall coat, black coat, which is a very heavy, big coat, which is amazing. Obviously it's gonna keep you warm, good quality. And it just looks like that. It's just a plain black coat, but it has like a waterfall style coat. Um, it's got a belt to go around it's just to kind of hold you in you look very sophisticated you look very like posh in this coat um, Adol actually picked it up for me and he was like you need this coat even though it's a very like simple plainish coat you can accessorize this with like a nice bag with like a nice knitted scarf around and um, I don't know when I wear this coat I feel so sophisticated for some reason I don't know why but um, and nevertheless I picked this up in a size 10 and this had actually a 20% off so Miss Selfridge has a 20% off the the original price was £70 but I got it for £55 so £55 for a winter coat is a really really good price so I'm very very happy with that and yeah I feel like everyone kind of needs a black winter coat in their collection like a, ba a black coat goes with so many different looks and it just gives off it more of a sophisticated look I don't know why but it just gives you that look and I'm all for it. Um, so the next item I picked up is from Lovisa. How do you say it? Lovisa or Lovisa? I don't know. Anyways, um, I was going, I was looking for an anklet because my anklet for some reason just broke me and I don't know why. And I, I wear an anklet on a daily basis and I love it. So I went in looking for an anklet and I saw this beautiful one. It's actually a bracelet, um, but I was like, I want it. It's so so nice um, and then I thought let me try it on I know it's a bracelet so I'm gonna fit around my anklet but I was like let me see if I can pull it off so it was a little bit tight so I needed that little bit of an extension so for the bracelet for the bracelet itself it was 15 and 50 and this is real silver uh, sterling silver so I can wear this all the time and it won't rust I can have a shower all that good stuff so I was really impressed with that and then I needed that extra uh, thing just to like make the um, the bracelet and clear it a little bit bigger. I don't know what it's called. If you guys know, let me know. Let me see if it's on the bracelet. So, oh, it's a necklace extender. Duh, why didn't I think of that? So yeah, this um, necklace, neck, oh my God, I can't even speak. This neck <laughs> necklace extender was a five pounds. So all in all, this whole bracelet and clip was £20.50 which is a really really nice one it's like a double layer anklet and I think it's a really really beautiful finally found myself a new anklet and I am so in love with it so so in love with it if you haven't been to this jewelry place guys you need to go down because they have the most gorgeous necklaces rings earrings like everything you want they have obviously they've got custom jewelry but they've got obviously silver gold as well so if you wanted to buy it they've got the option. So I'm really, really obsessed with that jewelry place at the moment. Like I picked up a few earrings as well, but I don't, can't seem to find where I popped them. So we're just gonna ignore that. Yeah. Okay guys, so last but not least, I went to JD because it's basically Adol's favorite shop to shop in. He goes there to pick up tops, jeans, his foot asylum and JD, I feel like it's every guy's favorite shop to go in because they've got all the branded um, names and everything so yeah we went in and I saw this gorgeous Adidas long sleeve top um, a little secret I picked this up from the kids and junior se um, section I think this is like a 13 to a 14 year old kid size thingy imaging and it's actually really big so I was like what the hell um, this was 20 pounds and again it's yeah junior 13 to 14 um, it's a really cool casual a top for like the more of a casual day if I want to go to the gym which I haven't been to the gym in God knows how long which I kind of really need to but when I actually decide to join the gym again I am, I've got a new top and even to wear around the house slouch around in I love the arms look at it it's so nice it's got Adidas and Adidas is like one of my favorite like sporty brands so 
yeah, I'm really happy with that actually. Okay guys, so that is everything I picked up recently over the course of like the last few weeks and I'm so happy with everything. I'm just, I'm happy, okay, I'm happy. Um, so yeah, like I mentioned, I will feature everything that I picked up in the description or box below, so make sure you check that out. And um, please ignore if my voice sounds so croaky in this video. I'm kind of just recovering from flu, so my voice is just kind of all over the place. So I do apologize, but I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. If you guys did, don't forget to smash that thumbs up. And I shall see you guys really, really soon in my next video. Love you all so much, and that's it.